Hello, Chris from ePianos here. Hope everyone is keeping well. If you are one of those people who is thinking about changing from a Yamaha Tyros 5 to one of these, the Yamaha SX900 Mini Genos, then this video is for you. We've worked out our top five reasons, partly our opinions, but also uh, those of people that have already made the change and changed from a Tyros 5 to the SX900 keyboard. So hopefully going to give you a bit of information, make sure you're better informed about what the differences are and indeed whether it's worth making the change uh, up to the SX900. If you haven't already, make sure you're signed up to receive our regular keyboard, piano and organ emails. Keep track of the latest news on our website blog and why not have a look at some of our other videos uh, here. We've done demonstrations, comparisons on all of these models. Now, where were we? Reason number one, if you are thinking of making this change from a Tyros 5 to a better keyboard, then your options with Yamaha, of course, one of them is the Yamaha Genos, the flagship model. But as you've no doubt noticed, the price is rather high. And the nice thing about the Mini Genos, the SX900, is that it is way more affordable than changing all the way up to the Genos. But of course you get many of the same features. Indeed, just looking at the screen there behind me, you can see that uh, the operating system is the same as the Genos. Um, now operating of course on a touch screen system and it's proving to be really, really popular uh, with our customers. We're all rather used to using touch screen devices these days, iPads, iPhones, etc. So it seems only natural to be controlling the sounds of your keyboard in that way, uh, indeed controlling everything on your keyboard that way. And it's very intuitive. You pick it up straight away and it doesn't take long, believe me, to um, have changed from the Tyros 5 system, which is rather like a cash point machine, I think, with the buttons around the edge of the screen and the touchscreen system on uh, Genos, uh, sorry, the Mini Genos SX900 is just much easier to use. So the reason number one is it is much more affordable. It's not going to cost you as much, but you'll get many of the same features and functions as you get on the flagship Genos model. One of the big differences, of course, between the Genos and the SX900 is the speakers are built in, as you can see uh, behind me. And of course, um, it might not of course, pack the same punch as having the three speaker system that you're used to on your Tyros keyboard. But eventually, you, I guess you have to ask yourself, do you really need those three speakers with the uh, Genos keyboard? Uh, perhaps you're just playing it at home or taking it out and about. But you'll find that the Yamaha white speaker cones that you get in the SX900, they do pack quite a punch in there. And you might find that you can save yourself having to use up all that space and all those wires that you have with the three speaker system um, that you get on the flagship keyboards. Reason number two, we sort of touched on it there, the, um, the SX900 is much, much easier to carry around than your Tyros 5. Of course, you'll be familiar with Tyros 5s and the effort that goes into picking them up and taking them from room to room or going out to do performances. You have to undo all the cables and you have the three speaker system. SX900 has been designed to be very portable. You can just pick it up and put it under your arm. Even the edges of it are designed and contoured to be very useful handholds. Uh, weight wise, I'll put the dimensions on the screen, but it's only 11.5 kilograms rather than Tyrus 5 which is 14 kilograms. So if this is the type of thing you're moving around regularly, you might well find that SX900 is just gonna make your life so much easier when it comes to uh, traveling around with your keyboard. Reason number three for changing from a Tyros 5 to uh, the SX900 Mini Genos is you will have the latest keyboard technology. Remember that the SX900 is in fact newer than the Yamaha Genos and when it first came out it had features that even the Genos didn't have. Um, compared to uh, Tyros 5, um, SX900 is six years newer. Now that is a heck of a long time when it comes to digital keyboard technology, things like the touch screen, but also the way that the percussion and the sounds, the voices, the styles and the arranging of them, the technology has really progressed to give it a much more realistic sound 
uh, much more like listening to a live band in your room. And indeed, one of the most striking differences uh, we find, and we probably might be a little bit unfair in saying this, is when we played the two together for the first time, side by side, um, we quickly thought, blimey, that Tyros 5 does sound a bit toyish in comparison to SX900. And I don't want to knock it too much because Tyros 5 has been a wonderful keyboard for many, many years, but technology moves on. That's the thing, and with SX900, you would have the very latest Yamaha cutting edge technology. And I also have to mention that because of the operating system that you can see behind me with the touch screen, um, Yamaha can introduce quite significant feature upgrades, as they've done already with Genos, you may have heard, to version two. But this is the type of thing that Yamaha issue for free, bless them, because they're bods, they're clever guys and girls are always working on new features and functions and ways that the keyboard can work and they'll update them via software updates which you can have for free. Now um, they did used to do something similar on Tyros but it was fundamentally limited by the buttons around the screen that you can see there and the way that you operated the keyboard but this new operating system that we see in uh, Genos and SX900, SX700 allows for many more uh, significant upgrades as Yamaha issue them. So that's reason number three, you'll have your hands on the latest technology with an SX900. So our top reason number four for changing from a uh, Tyros 5 to a Yamaha SX900 is that, uh, and this is a quite a wonderful thing, you are already going to know for the most part how to operate this keyboard. Um, many of the systems remain the same because Yamaha have the attitude, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. So the terminology you'll be very familiar with. Things like registrations on their multi-pads, voices, styles, registrations, um, all of these things remain the same. In fact, looking behind me, you can see registration buttons, voice buttons, style buttons, styles uh, over on the left-hand side, voices on the right-hand side. We have found that people that have made the change from Tyros 5 onto SX900 um, graduate to it very easily. Of course there's a little bit of a learning curve at the beginning but it doesn't take long. A couple of, couple of days hard work and before you know it you're flying on an SX900 and indeed many people have got in touch with us um, and said crikey I wish my Tyros 5 had been that easy uh, to operate not just Tyros 5 but previous models as well. So that's reason number four is, frankly, making the change from Tyros 5 to SX900 is not going to be a painful one. It's going to be very easy because the terminology, the systems, um, the names for things are all the same, all common as Tyros 5. And indeed, your registrations that you've made will work on there. So if you spent years and years making registrations on Tyros 5, you'll be able to transfer them on a USB stick, put them on your SX900 and use them in just the same way. So well done to Yamaha because they make it really easy for us keyboard players to graduate from one keyboard to another. Thanks very much for watching. I hope that's been useful to you. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments section below or just give us a ring, send us an email, talk to us on the live chat. It'd be good to hear from you, see what you think. Uh, if you've made the change already, I hope you're enjoying the SX900. Uh, we've got some great deals on part exchanges. If you want to trade in your Tyros 5 or indeed any of your old Tyros keyboards, for an SX900, have a look in the link below. Uh, we've got a big chart with prices on there. You can find your price um, and just get in touch. Deliveries free. Our chaps uh, trained to come out and do the swap over for you, make sure everything's working. Then we invite you to stay in touch with us if you get stuck with anything, if you need any help. And of course, you have access to all of our guides and all of our videos uh, and the expertise inside our heads as well. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now. And if you're wondering what reason number five was that I haven't mentioned, well, frankly, it's because you deserve a treat, don't you? So go on, get yourself a new keyboard. Have a look at our deals below.